go touch some expensive stuff. Do we? Ah! I'll put the marbles back, I swear! Who sent you? Ma Beagle? Glomgold? Answer me! <laughs> Uncle Scrooge! <laughs> Uncle Scrooge? Oh my gosh, the nephews! Wait, you know us? <laughs> of course! Researching Mr. McDuck and his family is kind of my hobby. What? What are your blood types? What's Donald really like? Who's the evil triplet? Louie. Louis. Eh. Tell me everything! Um, we live with our uncle on a boat. Go on. Kinda it. We're just a normal, boring family. Normal? Boring? Ha! Ugh. Whoa. Whoa. Huey, Dewey, and Louie Duck. Scrooge McDuck's great nephews and his sister Hortense's side with Quackmore Duck twice removed! And you are? Oh, right! <laughs> Webby Vanderquack. My granny's the housekeeper. Wait! Are we friends now? If we say yes, will you let us live? <laughs> Good one, new best friend! So, friend, what do you do for fun around here? Oh, I'm the best at fun. Um. Yeah! At least it's not the marble room. Death darts was fun! Again, just supposed to be darts. Oh, what do you want to play next? Mystery Murder Island? Cannonball Fury? How about a nice, safe nap? Oh, how about Sacky Sack? <laughs> or we could go have some real fun. You mean, I do, dear Dooford. It's time for Funzo's Fun Zone! What's that? Only the greatest place one could ever imagine imagining! Where your dreams become reality, and reality becomes some crazy kind of hyper dream! Where punch refills are free! Funzo's Fun Zone, where fun is in the zone! Oh yeah, that Funzo's, of course! Huh, everyone knows Funzo's. Let's go, boys! Oh, well... Have fun. You coming? What? Yeah! Let me get my stuff! I don't know. Webby's great for treasure hunting and minecart chases, but she's not exactly built for everyday kid stuff. I still see the darts when I close my eyes. She's been cooped up in a mansion her whole life. Of course she's gonna be a little off, but we can help her. She'll be fine. All right, Webby. Just a totally casual hangout in the real world, like regular kids do. Play it cool. Yeah, play it cool. You've been on a bus before, right? Absolutely! So, is it a signed seating or a... Don't talk to anybody, don't touch anything, don't lick anything, don't go near the emergency brake! Sorry. It, it's fine. It's just a short walk to Funzo's. They're the sketchiest neighborhood in town. <sighs> Bet it's a faster run! Race ya! Uh, wrong way. Was a bad person. Okay. What? This is one mystery we don't have to solve. <gasps> I need to know the truth, whatever it is. Yeah! 
Hey, you're not Della. You know Della? Where is she? Please tell me she wasn't an evil family betrayer and spear stealer. Who are you anyway? Dewey, that's Celine, the goddess of the moon. Hi, I'm Webby. I heard Scrooge and his family were on the island, so I wrote a super spooky prophecy on the door to lure my friend Della. That usually does the trick. So where's the spear of Celine, Celine? What spear? The one Della took from your garden. You mean the sphere of Celine? Why does no one get what I'm saying? The spear of a Celine. I've never had a spear. Do you mean the sword of Celine? That's down the hall. No, the spear of Celine, the one my mom took, the one that's our only clue to finding her. Ah, uh, you're Della's kid. I should have realized you're just like her. I'm sorry, I haven't seen her in years, and I don't know what the Spear of Selene is. So we're back to she stole Scrooge's spear and betrayed the family then. Great. What? No way! She loved her family more than anything in the world. Oh, Della wasn't just a good person. She was the greatest, and she made everyone around her better. Maybe the spear isn't an artifact. Maybe it's something else. Your mom did love a good mystery. Here, it's not a spear, but... It is a treasure even Della never found. Don't give up, young duck. Your mother never did. Now the child was a bit of an X-factor, but she will be the cherry on this sweet ribbon. Leave her out of this heron! She's just a defenseless girl. She has no place here. A damsel in distress is what she is. It was a mistake to bring a hapless hellion. She should be at home with her pink booze, enjoying a glass of her favorite tea. I don't like tea, I like... <gasps> this bores me. Time to move on to the revenging. <laughs> what are you, child? That's Webby Vanderduck, my new partner. Yeah, but it's actually Vander... Whoa! 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 Webby! I love it! I'm like a super mega rubber ball of death! You get Heron, I'll get your granny. The juice! Call 78, get your opponent to underestimate your partner. Clever! How do you know she could pull it off? Your granddaughter is full of surprises. Ah, get away! Get away! Give me that juice, you bad baddie! No! No! It's wearing off! No! This is all your fault! Flip six three hole. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it worked! Team up! Are you sure there's nothing I can give you? Maybe some original family photographs? Or a leather-bound volume of MacDuck history? I'm probably just going to throw most of it away anyway. I... Uh, words... can't... Uh... Well, goodbye then. See you all in five years.